MEK supporters hold rally in different countries mark resistance leaders' freedom from Shah's prison. Iranians, supporters of the MEK and the National Council of Resistance of Iran, held simultaneous protests in different countries on Saturday. They expressed their support of the Iran protests and celebrated the anniversary of Masoud Rajavi, the leader of the Iranian resistance, gaining freedom from the Shah's prison in 1979. These protests were in the United States, Sweden, the Netherlands, Denmark and Germany. The MEK and NCRI supporters held banners in solidarity with the nationwide Iran protests. They also held pictures of Rajavi, honouring his dedication to the cause of freedom for the past five decades and leading the Iranian resistance through hardships. Cross-party members of parliament strongly support Iran protests. At a conference in the House of Commons on Tuesday, cross-party MPs and peers discussed the future of UK policy on Iran following the recent protests in the country. They strongly supported the protests which continue across the country despite the authorities' brutal response with the IRGC and security forces killing at least 1,500 protesters and arresting thousands more. In her message to the conference, the President-elect of the National Council of Resistance of Iran, Mariam Rajavi, said, I thank you for supporting the uprising of the people of Iran by urging your government to adopt a decisive policy against the Iranian regime and to recognise the right of the Iranian people to resistance. The Iran uprising will not be stopped. The struggle of the people of Iran, the resistance units and the rebellious youth will continue until the end of the religious fascism. Albanian anti-terrorism units expel two Iranian agents. Two individuals dispatched by the Iranian regime to Albania as diplomats were recently expelled on espionage charges by the government of Tirana, according to a January 19th report aired by Top Channel TV in Albania. Mohamed Ali Az Payman Emati and Sayad Ahmed Hosseini Alast, ordered to leave Albania as persona non grata, were expelled from Albania on Saturday night under tight security measures by Albanian anti-terrorism units. 20 anti-terrorism officers of the Albanian government escorted the two diplomats and their families from their apartments to the airport, supervising their final departure from Albania under extremely tight circumstances. On December 18, 2018, the Albanian government expelled the Mullah's ambassador and head of the intelligence branch in Albania as persona non grata and terrorism security threats. <laughs>